Hey, what's up guys? Today I'm going to be showing you how to make a hole in an object without having to use boolean. I'll give you an example of what you might have been doing previously by using boolean to make a hole in an object, I suppose. Um, you're probably doing something like this, and you'd go here, you add your boolean, go here, and you do your difference, apply that boolean, and you do this. But when you do this, you have pretty bad topology, and no one wants to go in and press J on each and every one of these. So instead, what you're going to want to do is go in through here. You press E, S, hold control, so that way you get that uniform scaling. Do it to one side, do it to the other. You're left with this shape. You have all these quads right here. And then you're going to go delete one, delete two. I'm on edge select mode right now. Select both edge loops by holding Alt, Shift. I'm going to right click and do Loop Tools Bridge Edge Loop. If you can't find that, you're going to want to do Edge. Then you're going to find Bridge Edge Loops right here. And then that will bridge your edge loops. And then you're left with this nice shape. This also works with cuboids. You can sort of inset them. And uh, delete your faces. And you have that same concept of bridging those edge loops. And then if you want to boolean, you know, you're able to do that and you can keep your nice quad topology through this technique.